Long arm application. For indications where immobilization of the wrist joint and elbow are required, follow physician's instructions on the proper positioning of the limb. A common position is with the elbow flexed to 90 degrees, wrist in slight dorsal flexion, and neutral with regards to ulnar and radial deviation. Cut a 6 inch length of 1 inch stockinette. Cut halfway across the stockinette, about one third down the length. Then, slide stockinette over the wrist and apply cut section over the thumb for protection. Another option is to measure the length to the thumb and make a cut at that length to slide over the thumb. Select a stockinette that will not be restrictive at the widest part of the limb. Make sure you use enough stockinette to allow fold backs at distal and proximal ends. Now, roll up the stockinette before applying to the limb to lessen pressure while applying. Roll on and remove all wrinkles and creases. A small cut in the antecubital fossa may be needed to remove fold. Make a small cut in the stockinette for the thumb. Next, cut stockinette at distal thumb side for easy fold back. Using 2 inch or 3 inch padding and starting at the wrist, go through the web space and work toward the elbow, overlapping by 50%. Continue proximally around the elbow to the upper arm. Avoid placing the edge of the padding in the antecubital fossa. Applying with a slight tension will allow the padding to lie down smoothly and have a snug fit. Additional padding may be required for bony prominences. Make sure patient limb position is correct before starting to apply the cast tape. Begin by putting on protective gloves before applying the cast tape. Dip 2 inch or 3 inch cast tape in water, squeezing 1 to 3 times. Remove from water and squeeze 1 time to remove excess water. Start wrapping the cast at the wrist and go through the web space. Then go around the hand and continue with 50% overlap toward the elbow. Avoid placing the edge of the cast tape in the antecubital fossa and continue wrapping toward the upper arm with 50% overlap. Fold back the stockinette at proximal end, thumb, and distal side for protection of the skin and creating a soft end. Take a second roll and dip 2 inch or 3 inch cast tape in water, squeezing 1 to 3 times. Remove from water and squeeze 1 time to remove excess water. Start wrapping the cast at the wrist and go through the web space. Go around the hand and continue with 50% overlap toward the elbow. Avoid placing the edge of the cast tape in the antecubital fossa and continue wrapping toward the upper arm with 50% overlap. Be sure to leave approximately one half inch of stockinette exposed to leave a soft end. Mold the cast with the palms of your hand. Check for any limitations in range of motion. Check for any pressure points that may cause irritation. And you are finished.